Welcome back, guys. Oh, God, I just burped and hiccuped that fucking... Uh. That was rough. Oh, look, second chance at that fucking lizard. Come on. Put your twinkle on my cock. Twinkle toes, twinkle toes, motherfucking twinkle toes. What the fuck is gotcha. a twinkle toes jingle? How did it fucking go? That's a chunk. That's a chunk? Holy shit. Twinkle toes? I don't know. Twinkle twinkle little star? Try. Wait. I hear a bow and arrow drawing. What's the noise? You're, you're touching his stuff. You don't like that. Where is he? He said it's... The guide says he's right here. Maybe he... There's a... Specific trigger for his fight? There's so many bloodstains here. What happened? Hold on. Horus. Hold up, hold up. Let's touch this bloodstain. Let's see what happened. Okay, right, follow this path in the area. We find Horus the Hushed Waiting, wielding a halberd. Halberd? Oh, well. What happened to you? He, apparently, he's just supposed to be here. Ooh. Does he show up when I leave? Free loot, I guess. <laughs> wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait a minute. If I'm Ember, does he come? Maybe it's like one of those things where it has to be like it's an evasion. Uh, this dude just is Horus, bro. What? Try treasure. What? Guys, I killed Horus by accident. Thanks for watching. Um. Um. Continue the game, pass Abyss Watchers, head into the catacombs, find Henri, who will tell ask you about Horace's location. Uh, who the fuck's Henri? Henri is... Oh, wait, is that the bitch in the church? That's the bitch in the church. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember, I gotta talk to so, Henri, this and is, then Horace so is down here. Horace is, is her companion, and I, after you enter the catacombs, he becomes hostile and is now stalking her. Oh, fucking, fucking dune, dune worm, sand bro. buckets trying to kill me, bro. Alright, bro. It's the dune flashlight. Let's do it. Does he have, like, fucking lightning power? Yeah. Better watch out, bro. Y'all gonna kill it? Y'all gonna fight the worm? No. <laughs> Why would you commit? Why would you commit? Don't commit to my dumbass bits. Damn it, just the movement is what kills me. Fuck. Fuck. You gonna nerf yourself before going in to fight old God! Dick oh god. <laughs> Fucking. Never mind, you don't get to fight old Dick Cheese. We don't get fun. Not old Dick Cheese now! <laughs> Man, fucking Horus ain't even fucking worth it, bro. His homeboy's got a shield. Bro, Horus the shield? Bro, don't don't tell me that. You know I love Horus the Shield. Bro, like this game I love the side quest in this game because this game just is like Like, hey, do you want an, an arrow to point you where to go? You wanna go? Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. We get it. We get it, bro. You're you were a celebrity because you were a popcorn bucket. We get it. Subscribe God, to my oh, fuck off! <laughs> subscribe to my OnlyFans! <laughs> no! <laughs> subscribe to my only Stop it! <laughs> <laughs> How are you not dead, bro? Just go, just go, run. I'm, fucking, I'm not questioning, I'm just going to the old Dick Cheese. Hey, Dick Cheese! Where you at, buddy? I'm not Dick Cheese, I told you to stop calling me that! <laughs> No, you're definitely Dick Cheese. Come on. It's the old Dick Butt King, bro. Let's do it. That did not a damn thing in terms of damage. 
yet. Um, when I did my fist run, uh, years ago, this was the fucking boss that, like, kicked my shit in. Because prior to him, I had been beating everybody in one to two, tri one to two tries. And then old Dick Butt King here fucking rocked my shit. Oh, shit. Let's try to run through it, not into it. <laughs> Holy shit! This is gonna be a fun yeah. fight. This is, this is gonna be the next episode. He was so <laughs> tough on me because he's got so many different fucking options for close range and long range. It was fucking difficult for me. The second half of this fight when he just starts lighting the room on fire. Wait, he starts fucking like a Draco meteor. <laughs> yeah, he's just like... <laughs> Fucking love him. I love old Demon King. He never was a problem for me because I actually used real builds by the time I got here. And <laughs> mind you, I never fought him at this point in the game. I would always go to um, the Boreal Valley and then come back. God damn it, this guy. I'm, I'm about to fight this worm because I'm just it's on principle, bro. <laughs> Wait, you... You you fight Vort of the Boreal Valley, and I know that. Is the place... Yes. Not the Boreal Valley where you fight him? No, you don't fight him of the... No. No, you fight him on the High Wall of Lothric. That's not in the Boreal Valley? No, the Boreal Valley is the blue sky area with the fucking crocodiles on the bridge. It's a grumpy old troll with a croc on the bridge. I just remember the fucking like nasty fucking bitch ladies on the other fucking side. They kicked my ass too. But I'm gonna be honest, okay. Chief. I don't remember getting much farther beyond that. Keep that combo up, please. Yo, there he goes. Shit. There you go. Kick him in the shins! Oh shit. He's he's gonna spice me. He's gonna spice me. Ouch! Ow. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh shit. Oh, Drago Meteor, bro. Watch out. Oh shit, shit, shit. Remember this one is just like run around the arena for a little bit and come back. <laughs> mm -hmm. Again, what makes this fight? No, no, no. What made this fight very difficult for me when I was playing this? Oh. Oh, it's the, the rings of fire. And then they come back, I believe. God damn! Oh, the no. meteors. Draco meteor, bro. Here they come. I do. I will say the arena design with all the dead demons is amazing because it gives you that cover. But it's also like thematically, like from a lore perspective, he is like the last demon. God damn it! Oh, that barely touched you, bro. You're good. You're good. Holy shit! That angle was weird. I was like, he was not like square on me at all. I don't like where I'm at right now. I'm gonna move. I need. I need to move. I don't like where I'm at right now. I'm like, I have a very bad feeling. I'm gonna get trapped in a corner and get fucked. Come on. There you go. Face me over here, bitch. There you go. Punch him in the butt hole. Alright. There's a ring of fire. Oh. oh I tried jumping. The heel here. And then... Big oh, slam. Good job. I, I like how that made it sound like I was congratulating the old Demon King for that. Alright. Good job, buddy. You did it. Oh god, get me out. Get me out. I need a reset, bro. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, okay. there you Fuck go. Yeah. Good opportunity. Take the heel, run around at the speed of sound. Running around at the speed of sound. Oh hell. No, oh hell. That was doing good. That was a good run too. Shit. You oh. were doing good. Especially considering the little uh, chip damage that you were doing most of that fight. Yeah, I was literally just picking at him, just like, bink, bink, bink. 
def I could have upgraded the this fucking sword that I have to for more damage, but I'm like scared to spend it because what if I'm like, what if I want to fucking become guts? Like you could become guts. <laughs> My biggest nuisance is this fucking worm, bro. Oh my god, do my <laughs> like What the fuck are you doing? Okay, I'm running. Son even looking the right way, stupid. Dude you don't even got eyes, he's just a worm, he's just like <laughs> worm. I always, I always thought it was weird how in certain, like, like, le um, not legend, like, fantasy worms are spelled weirms. Weirms? You think it's weird too, right? Wyrms? <laughs> yeah. Just like fucking wyverns. I'm like, why? Vern. <laughs> <laughs> it's just you talking to your fucking cousin at, like, the fucking family reunion after you find out he did some dumb shit. Why, Vern? Why? <laughs> <laughs> why, Vern? Are you still doing this one? Bro, fucking easy to dodge. Oh, that's not, that's not, that's not. <laughs> good shit. Slam attack. Skadoosh. Fucking wrapped on the floor. That fucking orange go looking like the wushu finger hole down here. Oh, God. Ouch. What? Oh, two of them? Bro, damn, bro. That's pussy shit. Fuck you, old demon king. <laughs> You built like a fucking upside down bottle. <laughs> Hate his ass, bro. Oh. I'm about to beat some ass, bro. Why? Why is all the demons in this game got the fattest fucking asses? Like, like why did why did Miyazaki? He was like, you know what? What are we gonna sexualize in this game? Fucking demons. Are we gonna sexualize the normal people? No, we're gonna make them look like fucking trolls. <laughs> every fucking- I want every NPC that's a human to look like they're a fucking gremlin. I don't want them to look human. I want them to be so uncanny that they just make you uncomfortable and you would kill that thing on sight. What about the demons, sir? I want them to have a fucking dump truck Pixar ass. <laughs> like... Fuck them. <laughs> You're not talking about Why? this demon. Talking? This demon got fucking... <laughs> You don't got the biggest dumpy. He, but like, he barely he built got a like dumpy a pair. at all, bro. He built like an upside down pair. Oh, those little teeny legs. Ah, well, okay. We're done. We're done. Picking that up. We're done, buddy. I'm not inviting you to my sleepover. Whoa! <laughs> oh, come on! I was in range for that. Damn. Oh, we're at that point. You went from having a good run to being like nothing but getting God. worse as you go. Yes. God damn it. That's the that's the worst part of Dark Souls when you have that one good run and you like miss it. And you're like, I got this, and it's just a fucking downhill fucking. Well, it's ride like from one there. of the stages of like hard boss fights, right? You go in, you get a feel for it. You have a decent run. Your second run or your third run, you go in there and you fucking rock it. You get this guy like three quarters of the way down, fucking easy cheese. Right, and then he gets you, and you're like, okay, okay, cool. Like I'm learning, I'm getting it, I'm getting there. Like this makes sense to me. And then from there, <laughs> the Shitting next the like <laughs> ten to fifteen, depending on how hard the boss is, twenty, twenty-five tries, you get just a little bit worse at it, and then you just get into this despair and like pride. Where you're just like, God fucking damn it, I know this guy, why is he giving me so much trouble? And you're sitting there, like, you go in there, you barely touch him twice before he just fucking picks you up and, like, mops the floor with your fucking forehead. And, <laughs> like, like elderly, just bro. fucking destroys you. And then, and then, after hours, after you get fucking angry for the first time. Typically, for me, after I start getting angry at the game, it's like, alright, cool, I'm gonna have to, like, step aside and, and just, like, fucking come back to this later, right? So you take your break, you take your mandatory break, and after that break... You step in, and you have an okay run, or two. You go through your usual bullshit another few tries, and then there's the one run, where you go 
ultra fucking instinct, man. You, you're all of the shit unlocks, everything clicks and makes sense, and you go through and you're whittling this guy down, and you're not letting any of his bullshit get to you, and you're blocking and parrying and dodging and shit. You're hitting him in all the fucking right opportunity windows to parry and counterattack, and you get him to about what 90 to 95 percent health. Gone. And then he kills it. And that was by far the closest run you had. And it's so disheartening when you lose. Because after that you go on an even worse losing streak. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking you repeat the cycle. And then the next time you have a decent run is when you actually beat him. But at that point, you're so fucking defeated from like going through the fucking motions of trying to. You don't even this celebrate. Guy. You just you're, go, you're oh, like fucking I did thank it. God I did it. And then God forbid you Me ever play the game again because you get to that, that point in the game and you're like, I don't want to fucking do this shit again, man. No, oh, bro, Poundboy got on his fucking knees for you. He was like, oh, come here. I also find it interesting that he goes into his second phase at like about two thirds health instead of half. Does the fire eventually run out? I usually just dodge roll yeah. through it. Usually? Oh, I didn't even believe that. I'm, I'm pretty sure. I could be wrong about that, but your jump tactic is also getting hit, so it's not like I could be doing much worse to you. Yeah, honestly, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I'm like 80% sure you can dodge roll through that. To be fair, the last time I gave you advice was on the fucking Crystal Sage, and that did not go <laughs> <laughs> as intended. <laughs> Or my strategy that I always did when I played was just get far away and then just go well, back. It does eventually fizzle out, you are correct. But then it gives them opportunity to do raid and shit like this. Don't, don't, don't stun. Get your ass up, you lazy bitch. Oh, run away, run away and heal. Run away and heal. No! God damn it. I should have healed. Well. Yeah, so like for me, that, like what you're describing to kind of like pick it back off of that. Like, what you're describing to me is essentially what happened to me with the Ornstein and Snow, Snow, Snow fight. Snow, um, Smog, Snow, Smog, Smoke? Snow, Smog, Smoke. Ornstein and Snow. Um, that was a hell of a fight in Dark Souls 1. Like, that is the peak fight in the base game, in my opinion. Like, no other fight is as good as that. Um, and I go in, I'm like, okay, I see the big guy, and then I see the other, and I'm like, whoa. Like, when I see both of them, I'm like, two, two fights, like, two bosses blew my mind. And I was like, okay. And then I, I died instantly. Like, Ornstein fucking went, shoot, and like teleported. He moves so quick. He like dashes forward at the you, like the second you walk in as Ornstein is like dragging his hammer. Mm -hmm. And I immediately got killed by him. And I got stunned. And the second I stood up, Ornstein, or uh, Smo, boom, hit me with the hammer. I was like, what just happened? Like, <laughs> and then you dodge a little bit, dodge a little, get hit, fucking get killed, like, it was this shit show, bro. And then I had to step away. And it got me to a point where I was like, I don't even want to play the series anymore. Like, I was done. Like, I was like, fuck this game. Oh, ow. Ouchie. That sizzled you a little bit. But, like, it got the, the fucking Ornstein Smoke fight, like, mm -hmm. for me. That shit was my fucking kryptonite in that game. When I beat it, I was so numb at that point, I didn't, like, celebrate. Like, I fucking beat it! I literally, I remember exactly what was happening. I was on a fucking, like, Xbox, because I was playing it on Xbox. I didn't even have my, like, a gaming PC at the time. That's how fucking long ago this was. And I was in a fucking Xbox Live party chat with Diaz, right? Mm -hmm. And he was, like, playing, like, Madden or some shit. Like, fucking some random game that... Like, we were playing two different games. I was like, yo, you want to just, like, Vibe and chill? Call. He yeah. was like, you want to just chill, like, while we play games together? And I was like, sure, man. Um, and then I was, like, beating it. And he's like, how have you been on this fight? Because we were playing for, like, a few hours, bro. Oh, shit, let me run. Um, and I was like, hey, I remember him being like, aren't you, haven't you been fighting this for a while? And I was like, Dude, yeah, yeah, I have. It's been hell. And he's like, dude, why don't you just stop the game? I was like, no, I gotta beat this. The new one, like, Dark Souls 3 is coming out soon. And I was like, I got to. And he's like, why? And I was like, my friend, I'm not gonna fucking say his name, but like, my friend, um, or I should say our friend in high school, um, 
he told me I have to play Dark Souls 3 because like, and I gotta beat it on my own. He said, don't do summons, don't do nothing, just I gotta beat it on my own. Um, which I would argue with him because I was like, you made, exactly. like, you played Dark Souls 2 with Dylan and you fucking went through the whole game with him and he used summons and you were like, and he was like, doesn't matter, you can't. I was like, fuck off. Oh, fuck off, you can do whatever the fuck you want. I, the only correct way to play Dark Souls is the way that makes it fun. 100%. I was like, but I, I granted, was like, it was a pride thing. I was like, I want to be yeah. able to fucking beat it. I mean, you saw me play mind. Elden Ring, bro. <laughs> I was trash at that fucking game. And I insisted on playing by myself. 100%. Um... And eventually, like, after, like, five minutes of that, I was, this was all still in one run. Um, I killed Ornstein. I was like, okay, I got the first guy. He was like, nice. Wait, he goes, wait, this is a second boss? Like, he did it, like, Diaz didn't realize this whole time I wasn't fighting one boss. I was fighting two. Just stay down and roll. Okay. Okay, heal. There's a bigger range on that attack than I realized. Jesus. Yeah, he has a big hammer. Oh. He's doing the fucking ring of fire. Yep, I gotta. Oh! But I think you can't roll through that. It was just a bad time I roll because so. I, I knew he could suck the the ring of fire back at him, and then the next one pushes out. Yeah, 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 cool. yeah, yeah, yeah. And then he's like, "There's a second one." I was like, yeah. And he's like, "Have you always been doing?" It? I was like, "Yeah, I've been. I've killed the second guy or like the first guy a few times." And he's like, "He's like, holy shit! I thought you were fighting one boss this whole time." I was like, "No, there's two. He goes, "No wonder it's hard." And I was like, "Yeah, dude, it's fucking fucked." Oh, yeah. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. You, you must be one with the hammer. What the fuck? How? Fucking heal. I know you're yeah, missing your him. window to be, uh, fuck him up, but. Never mind. It didn't fuck fucking yeah. matter. Um, what? I don't know what the fuck just happened there. <laughs> you tanked the fucking. I hit. literally got stuck in the hammer. <laughs> Whoa, bro! It's the hammer! <laughs> 25,000! Oh my god! Holy shit! Um, and I was like, okay. And then I was like, silent for a while. He was talking to me. I was like, uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. And then I beat him. And I literally just put the controller down. And he's like, are you good, bro? You've been real quiet. I'm like, I just beat the boss. He's like, what? I was like, yeah, he goes, aren't you excited? I'm like, I was like, I'm so happy. <laughs> just deadpans, I'm so happy. Yeah. He's like, hell yeah, man. And I was like, wow. <laughs> he's like, are you good? I was like, no. No, I'm not. I'm not. <laughs> I'm fucking pissed, man. <laughs> I was like, I was so empty. And then one what makes it all worth it. After you fight Ornstein and Smo, and you fucking go up that elevator, you see tits. Oh, yeah, the fucking giant lady with boobies. Yeah, dude. Fucking, I was like, made it, I was like, made it worth it. Whole game, absolutely worth it. Game, Miyazaki, you're a genius. You know exactly what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, my man. God. Look, this is the guy that fucking, the, the guy I just killed, dickhead. Fucking stupid. Oh, hell, man. Ooh, god damn it, guys! Welcome back to another episode of fucking Dark Souls Three. <laughs> <laughs> so we didn't, we didn't say nothing. <laughs> and talking oh. about boobies, welcome back to one last brain cell. <laughs> Sorry, fucking boobies. <laughs> <laughs> There's only one last brain cell between the two of us, and it's not. <laughs> I'd rather be between booby. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Front flips. Wait, which sword is this? This is the the wolf great sword. Mm. We can reinforce it, bro. No, you're gonna reinforce this and I go for the guts build. Well, this takes titanite skills. Wait, oh shit! This takes titanite skills too. Hail! <laughs> Hail! Okay, one sixty two, sixty four. Oh, this is the one. Cool. Let me do this. Really, be careful. All right, so. Look at, what, the, what does the demon, old demon king soul give me? Because, like, I thought it was the fist this whole time, but it's not. It's just that other random dude gives you that. So, what does he give? Old, okay. Gives you chaos bed vestiges. Stupid. And a hammer! He just gives me the hammer! Fuck yeah. That's actually pretty cool. I like, I dig the hammer. How does the hammer skill? Um... Hammer's got descaling right now, but it does fire damage too. 
fire damage. 180 plus 51 and then 69 plus 5. Heh, <laughs> 69. Um, so, fucking, this shit's wild. Um, but yeah, let me go, let me go actually fucking play the game. Let's go to the Boreal Valley. Right in the tank. <laughs> Erythial of the Boreal Valley. Yep, yeah, see? Wait. Is this the Boreal Valley, or am I, or am I in Erythial of the Boreal Valley? Okay, I'm in Erythial of the Boreal Valley. Wait, but but this is... Wait, 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 wait. So you can name places in the Boreal Valley of the Boreal Valley and people within the Boreal Valley of, of the Boreal Valley? That fucking yeah, makes so. no sense, because if I hear Erythial of the Boreal Valley following the naming uh, fucking rules it's gonna be set yes, by it's gonna fucking be Vort, this guy's fucking scary. He's kind of cute. Can I have one in D&D? No, no, everyone else has one, a fucking thing, no. <laughs> Technically, I can have a thing, too. He's just away. Oh, hell. You may have to use your sword on this guy, because he's fucking young. May have to. The sword's so slow. That's 230 damage. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Hit? <laughs> Damn. Is this guy like a one time mini boss? Uh, pretty sure. Oh, fuck. He's just quick, dude. He is quick. Well, just remember what fucking Andre the Giant told you. Pretty be careful. Oh, shit, you're right. I don't know why the fuck he's calling me pretty. That's not my name. The fuck is... <laughs> this is the problem with this guy. He just moves so it's like you get hit no matter what. <laughs> <laughs> His, His whole, whole body is a hitbox, hit yeah. which is... It's stupid. Welcome to the Boreal Valley. This is why I fucking hate this place. <laughs> Oh man, I'm about to say fuck this and go back to my sword. I don't even know why I upgraded this piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> he says after putting the resources into it. Hey. <laughs> yes. I remember the first time I came here, it was like, I didn't... Real, like, I didn't look back, I just was walking forward, because the game doesn't really, like, fucking jump you with things behind you often, right? And so I was like, huh? Huh? And I was fucking attacked, I was like, no, 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 what's that? And I, started, I saw there was another bonfire, and I started hauling ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I just looked up this creature. I didn't know what his name was. What's his name? It's Sullivan's Beast. Oh! I just killed Sully's dog! <laughs> Sully's gonna be real mad when he realizes I killed his dog. Oh no. Sully. What? The, oh, up there's Anne Orlando. That's the fucking. that one bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I love the games. I love how the way I describe games. That one bitch. Oh my god. Rest. This is this is it. This is real gaming right here, guys. Oh man. Apparently, yeah. they're very weak to fire. These guys? The, the, the Sullivan Beast. Is he? Yeah. He wasn't fucking weak to my fire, the hell? What's that? Stupid. We can let you get. Ow! Oh! These, these ones fucked me up good.
Really? Okay, what's up, pussy? Wham! <laughs> Why I yada? God damn. Um, actually, before you move on, um, we're actually at a good stopping point. <laughs> we are at a great stopping point. Let's see if I can fight this guy first. Oh, fuck, there's another... Maybe don't overcommit. <laughs> you don't. Guys! Thank you. Oh, fuck. Guys, thank you for watching. Oh, God. All right, hit the outro while you run for your fucking life. Oh, guys, remember <laughs> to, to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Um, remember to tell us what games you want us to, to play. We may play them one day. Um, anything else I'm missing, Diego? No. Alrighty, thanks, guys. Bye! <laughs>